okay. love doing laundry so this is kind of really exciting for me um a little i don't know it's not really a mudroom but it's like walkers i guess there's going to be some hooks we got some railroad spikes that we're going to put in there as hooks to like hang jackets and purses and you know all, like, all that stuff jeremy's garage <clears throat> So it's really full right now. Boxes. And that door goes out to the back yard. That door is the driveway coming in. Okay. Go back inside. So here we have. And that's the little globe that the electricians broke, but we have one coming in. <clears throat> this is supposed to be an office, but it's actually going to be more like a craft room. This is like our little guest bath. Look at the light fixture. It's so pretty. Can't really see it, but it's really cute. And it has a shower. It's just a little shower. And then we have guest bedroom, guest bedroom. It's a small little bedroom, but It'll be perfect for our guests. Look how pretty it looks outside. So pretty. It has a nice closet, like a big closet. Our guest bedroom, it's a nice closet. Okay. <clears throat> now, let's go back down the hallway. And dining room. It's right here. There's our little dining room. And the view will be out to the back. You can't really see it because the windows are kind of foggy and weird. It's like foggy outside. Kitchen. I love the countertop. They are so cool. They look like tree branches. So cool. That's where the oven goes. Okay, and look at this. On each side of the oven, there's this thing. And it is like a spice thing, like a spice rack <clears throat> for like your little bottles and stuff. And there's one on this side too. Ooh, that one's not attached yet, but there's one there. Um, so, dishwasher, our sink is really cool. It's like a big metal farm. Well, it's not really the farm style, but it's like a big sink. And then that thing right there holds two trash cans and it's gonna go right there. Um, and the refrigerator will go there. And then over there, that hole is gonna be a beverage, like a, a beverage, beverage center like a some type of little refrigerator uh, pantry not too big more cabinets okay so little bar area they haven't put the backsplash yet 
but we'll have bar stools going all the way around like that. Okay, living room. The best thing about the living room so far is the fan. Look at the fan, it looks like a windmill. Can I turn it off? How? Okay, we'll turn it off so you can see it looks like a windmill, it's very cool. And these big giant windows, there's our big tree out there in the back. I don't think I'm gonna put blinds or anything there. I'm just gonna have nice open windows, maybe. We'll have to see. Okay, next. Here is Madison. So her little area is this entryway right here. This is all her area. So it's kind of separate. Um, this is her bedroom. It's a pretty good size bedroom. And her closet is amazing. It has these drawers and these shelves and more shelves and it's, you can configure the poles for the clothing any way you like, depending on, you know, how, what kind of clothes you have and stuff. But I just love all the storage. And then she has a little door, it's like a pocket door. She can go into her bathroom right here. And she has, this was supposed to be a Jack and Jill, but we decided not to. There's the light fixture. It's very like industrial style, I guess, farmhouse. Anyway, uh, it was supposed to be a Jack and Jill, but since it's just her, instead of making a Jack and Jill, we made like a vanity area. So she'll, she'll have like a little seat right here. She has all these cabinets. Look at this, all these cabinets. So nice. And another one up here, that's where her toilet would go. Obviously her shower. And then this door goes back in here. And this is her like game room. She's gonna have her, we're gonna put um, our old couch, our couch that we have right now is gonna be in here. And this is gonna be like her little hangout room for her and her friends. And all her gaming stuff will be in here, her TV, all of her art supplies. She'll probably have, she has a gaming desk, but she'll probably have some kind of like art table because she's really into art these days. And she's got these shelves. I had them do it like this for all of her gaming equipment and art supplies and board games and just all the stuff that her and her friends are going to do while they're in here. So it's going to be cool. It's going to be a cool little hangout spot for her. And then, okay, our bedroom. Oh, there's the fan. Isn't that cool? And then here's kind of a view of the kitchen. We didn't put any pendant lights because, I don't know, I don't like a lot of stuff hanging around and I don't know. I didn't want to take away from that fan. I really like that fan. All right. Okay, so our bedroom has this little elevated type ceiling and we go into our bathroom. I think the bathroom and the laundry room are going to be my favorite places. I'm weird. Okay, so my bubble bathtub, what's it called? The jet tub. Jet tub. Yeah, jet tub. And shower. So it's like an open shower. And there's a shower head right there. And there's another shower head going to be over here so that we can both take a shower at the same time. And that's a bench, obviously. Anyway, it's like an open concept thing. You just walk into it. It's kind of different. Um, my vanity. So I'll have a seat there. And we did something kind of cool. We drilled a hole, a hole right here. So like the cord to like my hair dryer and stuff can drop down inside there and plug in. And then I don't have cords everywhere. I don't know. It's just my OCD thing about cords. I don't like cords. It's got this cool little corner shelf. I have no idea what I'm gonna put there. Something pretty. This is an answer prayer, y'all. Our previous house did not have a door that separated the toilet area from the rest of the bathroom. So yeah, it's not very private. 
But now we have it. You can come in here. Look, more storage. You can do your business with the door shut. It's so nice. Nobody has to know what you're doing in here. Just come in here, do whatever you want. And it's a secret. Very, very private. Okay, the closet. So this is not all put together yet, but this is like a shoe thing. It's like... The shelves are, I think they're like angled or something, so you put shoes on them. I don't know, all those boards right there, those are gonna be the shelves, but look at this. This is up here, that's a, like a luggage area for luggage or like your big Rubbermaid totes and stuff. And then there's another little shelf. And then, ta-da, look at that. I love it. And then we have all of this. Keeps going. This, like this and I'm thinking about getting some kind of little like a round ottoman type seat thing to go in there so like you can sit down in there I don't know why but just like to put your shoes on and stuff okay we have these French doors with the little blinds that are inside the glass and it goes out to the back patio which is Another favorite place. Oh my gosh. Oh, I wish you could see the tree. Well, there's the tree and the neighbor's house, but there's going to be a fence there, so you won't see that house. Um, that's going to be painted. I forgot what color. Maybe white. And look at these fans. Aren't they cool? So it's a pretty good sized patio. It's pretty big. And there's our tree. That tree is like the whole reason why we wanted to move here. And then there's part of our fence started. Pool. Swimming pool. Yay. So it's going to be kind of like built up. It's hard to explain. But it's going to be really cool. It's going to have like these little water <laughs> fountain things on this side. That's going to be the deep side. I think. Is that the deep side? Yep. Okay, that's the deep side. And then this, yes, that's right. This is the shallow side. So like right here, you get in, there's gonna be, this is all gonna be a sun deck. So it's just gonna be like shallow and you can put a chair in it, but you can still kind of like be in the water, but not totally in the water, sitting in your chair. And it'll have like these little bubble or like little spouts that just like bubble water. And then it's just like a deck and then it drops off and that's the pool and then that's the deep end and down there is where there's like three little waterfall things and back there is um where all the septic tank stuff is it'll be hidden and there's our big backyard we still have a lot of backyard left some trees jeremy cleaned up all the brush and trees and they're like so perfect now and beautiful all that was all vines and moss and like nasty brush. And now it's just, you can see all the way to the fence. Um, our fence is like halfway done. We still have to go all the way up here. And, oh, there's one more cool thing. One more cool thing. So like, if you are having a party or something in the patio or whatever, you can go to the bathroom. This is a little bathroom. Oh, it's locked. That's okay. That's okay. It's just it's just a little bathroom. It just has like your basic stuff, a sink, a toilet, a little cabinet. But anyway, there's going to be a bathroom there. And there's that garage door that I showed you earlier. And there'll be like a sidewalk that goes right here. And so you walk out this way. Oh! almost fell. You'll walk out this way and see the tree again. Oh, it's such a big tree. I love this tree. Um, walk out this way and this is where the driveway is going to be. It's going to be like a L shaped driveway kind of. So you have enough room to like back out and then drive forwards down the driveway because I suck at backing up. So that's going to be good. And there's some more of our trees right there and garage door 
and then oh some more trees look at the sunset front yard trees so pretty and they're back in the front and that's the end of the tour but I'm gonna just come up here a little closer to the beams because that was my idea and I'm really proud of it I really wanted those beams kind of makes the house look like a lodge or cabin or I don't know I just really like it it's very country we're the only house on the street that has like a country vibe all the other ones are like I don't know what they are Mediterranean I don't know but <sighs> it's a country neighborhood so and we are totally totally ready to move in because look at this wouldn't you be ready to move into this house <laughs> 